Greetings and salutation, you mad marble maniacs. This is Frankie Day, back again on YouTube. Uh, mad Modelers AZ Snap Group Build. Okay, dog. Get that. No room for you. Sarinara, Joe. <laughs> Update finished build. Okay, folks, here she is, guys. Right here is my AM62 Japanese Zero. She's all complete, done. I finished her and she's uh, now completed. And we'll zoom in a little bit. And then, simply, folks, this is my new camera right here. So I'm going to try to get used to doing this. And uh, we'll zoom in a little bit here. We'll take a little walk around on it. And here she is, folks, in all her might. This is the Mighty AM620 Model 21. This aircraft will trade in the attack of uh, Pearl Harbor. Flown from the aircraft carrier USS Akagi. And uh, it's painted in Imperial Japanese light gray. And a typical color for early uh, zeros that were painted in that era. Cow painted black. Spinner was painted the same color as the overall finish. Japanese, Imperial Japanese uh, light gray with a black cowling. Propellers were all aluminum. No cuff markers, warning bands on the propeller cuffs. And uh, She's uh, came out pretty good, guys. These these Pegasus snap type kits in my book are very, they're very nice kits. I mean, I enjoy the hell out of them. We'll zoom a little more and see how much we can do here, folks. There's a close up right there of the cockpit. That cockpit took about two hours for me to finish that cockpit up, and uh, all masked down and everything. Airbrush the same color as the as the airframe itself. And uh, there's a front end of the prop. Also, it makes this camera pick up the uh, engine details a lot better. Perhaps I'm not focusing it very correctly. Uh, you got to excuse my stupidity, folks. I'm not too keen on cameras, but it's made this a new toy, and we'll see how this video goes. So, right here is going to be the complete uh, build of Mad Modeler's. It's a snap group build. And I'd like to thank Clint for letting me get in his group build. It's been an enjoyable build. There's been a lot of builds out there in this, in this category of group build and the snap tight. I wouldn't mind doing another one. Perhaps another time I'll do another one. I, I haven't got to maybe have some more snap tight kits out there that will be coming out in the market. But anyway, guys, uh, like I say, this is act, this is actually was, was this kit was actually intended for the for the beginner in mind. You get a child that's five, six years old and never built plastic models before and wants to get into modeling. These snap tight kits make excellent choices. And when they graduate from snapping models together, they can go ahead and use the, the full strength method of using glue and paints. I wouldn't mind getting another one of these and painting it in a dark green off the Kaga carrier. And uh, it makes an excellent addition to your Japanese uh, aircraft collections. Uh, it's been a very good build for me. I really enjoy it. And I hope you great fellows out there enjoy it too. Uh, so far, there's no, there's no bad set issues at all in this kit. They, it goes together quite nicely. And uh, like I say, it speaks for itself. For a snap tight kit, you can't beat it, guys. So the AM620 is now complete. She's finished. And uh, right now I'm going to move to uh, the ED group build and start getting my B26 Marauder. I get the filler sanded off on it and give it a primer coat. i make a video of that. I won't be able to post that to tomorrow, folks. Uh, I, I had a few things I had to do today and getting those cameras one of them. And uh, I had to go get some uh, groceries at the store and everything. We got another cold front, some snow coming in here. So I want to make sure the hatches are all dogged down and... And the, and, the, and the ship is a uh, farewell for even keel for fairly farewell sailing and uh, again I'd like to thank everybody out there for your wonderful comments on this airplane on my group build here 
and uh, so please stay tuned for the video on my D-Day group build feature my B-26 Marauder and uh, after I get the Marauder all squared away here if the video now I'll start getting on the uh, Sky Raiders I may start on the, on one of them the, the one of my Sky Raiders tonight that's going and I uh, might post a video on that so anyway I want to see how this video comes out with this new camera I got fellas you know and it's it's awful new and I bought it today and uh, it's very uh, it's going to be very enjoyable to use this new, a new camera I can't believe that these things are so small compared to the, the old uh, camcorders I got but this just sent me back 150 bucks, boys, and I've seen some out there as $1,500. Oh, my God, who the hell's got the money to buy something like that? So I got this at Best Buy. It was on sale. I think it retailed uh, $199. I got $159. Not bad. Okay, boys, right now is this, right now is this completes uh, Clint's Mad Modelers uh, group build on easy snap type models. And the and the and the poster work and the introduction is is in a tribute to our, to our Panzer Bill, and uh, everybody gets the joy of everybody trying to be like uh, Panzer Bill. But there's only one Panzer Bill on YouTube, and that's Panzer Bill, boys. No matter how good or how comical you can be, there's only one Panzer Bill out there that can really make the videos come alive with comedy and and pure love for fellow man and. And models okay boys right now I'd like to thank you everybody for tuning in may God bless and we'll catch you on the next video uh, and uh, that'll be that so happy modeling and please subscribe this is Frankie Day signing off we'll catch you later boys bye now man